The most recent update from the NOAA at 10 a.m. British summertime located Hurricane Ophelia about 295 miles south-southwest of the Azores. The Category 2 hurricane is racing across the Atlantic at 24 miles per hour, with maximum sustained winds of 100 miles per hour. Ophelia will be a post-tropical cyclone by the time it reaches the UK and Ireland but will likely still have winds nearing hurricane strength. The NOAA said little change in strength is expected today, followed by slow weakening on Monday and Tuesday. However, Ophelia is still expected to remain a powerful cyclone for the next couple of days as it approaches Ireland. Hurricane Ophelia Path Update Live at NOAA's latest map shows Ophelia's path reaching Ireland after 7 a.m. on Monday morning, moving on to Scotland by 7 a.m. on Tuesday morning. Heavy winds nearing hurricane strength are forecast to batter the British Isles as the storm approaches. The Met Office has issued a yellow weather warning for the west coast of Britain and Northern Ireland from 12 p.m. until 11.55 p.m. on Monday, with winds of up to 80 miles per hour expected. Strong winds could create chaos with power outages, damage to buildings and impact on transport links. Friday, October 13, 2017 Hurricane Ophelia approaching Met Office Chief Forecaster Steve Ramsdale said understandably, there is a lot of public concern about the potential impacts of exophilia. In readiness, we have already issued yellow wind warnings for Northern Ireland and parts of Western and Northern Britain for Monday and Tuesday, suggesting wind gusts possibly reaching up to 80 miles per hour in places. While the West faces extreme weather conditions, the east of England will enjoy temperatures in the mid-20s due to tropical air being broadened by the hurricane. NOAA Hurricane Ophelia Latest NOAA Path NOAA Hurricane Ophelia Earliest Reasonable Arrival Time of Tropical Storm Force Winds Although parts of the UK may experience severe conditions, it's important to realize that not all areas will be affected by this ex-hurricane, Mr. Ramsdale said. For example, much of eastern England will be unusually warm for the time of year but quite breezy on Monday and Tuesday. In Ireland, a red wind warning the highest level possible has been issued for Galway, Mayo, Clare, Cork and Kerry from Monday 9 a.m. until Tuesday 3 a.m. Met Air and said mean wind speeds in excess of 80 km per hour and gusts in excess of 130 km per hour are expected, potentially causing structural damage and disruption, with dangerous marine conditions due to high seas and potential flooding.